Not sure what this is, but I better check it out. I'll make quick work of you. So that's all, huh? It isn't Goku. Well now, this could be fun. But if it isn't him, then who is it? I'll make quick work of you. So that's all, huh? Guess I'd better look for more. Well now, this could be fun. Where the hell could he be? Unlike anything I've ever felt before. Well, now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this. <laughs> after all. Who the hell are you? I don't have time to waste with you. Wait a minute. This is a Namekian, isn't it? What the hell is a Namekian doing on this planet? If that's true, then what are you even doing here? You got a death wish? <laughs> You've got spunk. I like that. Hmm. A power level of 322, huh? You're definitely stronger than the others. But you wouldn't even be a warm-up for me. You're making a mistake in underestimating me. Let's see if you can make this fun for me. Just what is it with this guy? <laughs> No way! Tick-tock! 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 
That all, huh? Is it my turn now? Time to show you what real power looks like. <clears throat> I'm getting another large power reading. That's got to be Kakarot. <clears throat> Im impossible. Who the hell is this guy? And where is he going? <laughs> well, if it isn't Kakarot, you've grown. You look just like our old man. What? Tell me, Kakarot, what is this? You were supposed to exterminate all life on this planet. What have you been doing all this time? Huh? Who are you? And who's Kakarot? Should I know who that is? You have got to be kidding me. You don't remember. Fine then, allow me to refresh your memory. You're not from this filthy planet. You were born on planet Vegeta. You're a member of the proud and mighty warrior race, the Saiyans. And that's not all. I'm your older brother, Raditz. You're lying! That can't be true! Long ago, you were sent to this pathetic planet to rid it of all life! We say and search the universe for habitable planets and wipe out all who live there so that we can sell those planets to the highest bidder. Weak, snot-nosed brats like you are sent to low-level planets, like this. And fortunately, it looks like this one's got a moon. Uh, if this guy's telling the truth, then these Saiyans are some real bad dudes. Wait. What about the moon? What does that have to do with anything? Don't play dumb with me. We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. Eh? I don't know what you're talking about. You know, I think Krillin's right. You guys are the worst. My name's Son Goku, and I'm from Earth. Take your lies and get out of here. <laughs> well, I couldn't even if I wanted to. Because Planet Vegeta was blown to smithereens by a meteor. Almost all of our brethren have been turned to space dust now. Uh, Including me and you, there are only four Saiyans left. Just the other day, we found a planet that should fetch us a high price. The three of us were going to have a hell of a time trying to overtake it. And that's when I remembered you. Kakarot. The planet is as good as ours if you join us. Come on, Kakarot! Think of the fun we'll have! Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement? Just shut up! If you think I'm joining you, then you're dumber than you look! Huh. Fine. Be that way. That little runt with the tail behind you is your kid, right? I guess I'll just take him instead. 
come any closer and I'll knock you sky high! Back off! <laughs> oh yeah? Well, go ahead if you think you can. Gohan's not going anywhere with you! Uh, what the hell's with this guy? You're not my brother. You're nothing to me! What's wrong? You scared? Yeah, go on! Get out of here! Kakarot, don't turn your back on your family! Your people! What the hell happened to your tail? I had it cut off a long time ago! Why would you do that? Do you know what? This planet isn't half bad. I think it could serve as our next target. Here goes! Your kid's in real trouble if this is the best you can do. What? Don't worry, Kakarot. I'll make sure to take good care of the boy. If you want him back, then you better do as your big brother says. Give him back. Don't even think about trying to be a hero. <laughs> no! No! Bulma, you still got that dragon radar? Oh, I get it! That decoration on Gohan's hat was a dragon ball! All right, I'm off! It's now or never! You're as good as dead on your own. Neither of us has what it takes to face him head on. At least if we tried on our own. But together, if we were to team up, we just might be able to take him down. Yeah, you're probably right. But can I really trust you? What's your angle in all this? Don't get the wrong idea. It isn't that I care in the slightest about your little kid or the Earth. That fool is the only thing standing between me and world domination. The moment he and his cronies are out of the picture. I'd finally rid myself of you. Then the world will be mine for the taking. You're crazy if you think I'm about to let that happen. But for now, I guess we gotta join forces. I guess there's really no getting around that. Precisely.
gone. Just a little longer. Goku, get a move on. Quit messing around. You really don't recall anything about the Saiyans that Raditz clown was going on about? No, nope, none of it rings a bell. It's crazy. I had no idea I had an older brother either. <laughs> I was hoping to milk some useful information out of you for our fight. His tail's probably his weak point. If we can squeeze his tail, he should be vulnerable. That's what happened whenever mine got grabbed. How are we supposed to grab his tail? This thing's giving off a lot of energy. We're closing in on him. Let's head down and move in for the attack. No. He's using a device that tells him our strengths as well as our location. Safe to say he probably knows we're close by. Gotcha. I'm guessing that means we've just got to meet him head on. this a power level of 710 where the hell Kakarot's kid no way damn this thing must be busted what another reading and it's heading straight for me there's one no there's two with power levels 322 and 334 they've come So, what brings you chumps here? Isn't it obvious? I'm here to get my son back! Where is he? You're hiding him somewhere, aren't you? His screaming was giving me a headache, so I locked him up in there. But forget about the rot. Don't tell me you actually think you stand a chance against me. You fool! You're not even fit to call yourself a Saiyan! Prepare to die! You know, believe it or not, battles aren't just about strength. Oh, that gives me an idea. You're pretty arrogant for scum. Man, he's fast. Attacking in the blink of an eye. <laughs>
Even with your combined power, you're still pathetic. But considering you weren't smart enough to heed my warning, don't deserve to live. You gotta be kidding me! You know what? Since you're going to die anyway, I might as well tell you something. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier? They're even more powerful than me. If you've got a new attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku! <laughs> Sorry. I'm fresh out. <laughs> Lucky for you, I actually came up with a new technique while I was training. Really? A plan? Ha! It'd be easier just to lie down and wait for the sweet release of death! I'm just gonna need enough time to charge up the proper energy for it. <clears throat> gonna need you to keep him busy while I deal with this. Got it. I'll do what I can. Hope you're ready for this. Special Beam Cannon! Huh. You just don't know when to quit. You? Alone? What were you two trying to decide who gets to die first? We ain't planning on losing. No way! My power! The playtime's over! Farewell! Yeah! 
cosmic power! Rock, paper, scissors! Rock!
just because you're my little brother. Yes! Yes, that's what I like to hear! It'll all be over soon! <laughs> Don't get comfortable! You're next! Damn, if I try to hit him now, he's just going to dodge it! me Goku won't be dead for very long what didn't you know this planet is home to the Dragon Balls they grant wishes absolutely any wish imaginable even bringing someone back from the dead uh, damn it well my comrades will be happy to hear that <laughs> Everything you just said was 
transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once they've learned that I've died, they will come here. How long until then? When, when will they... When do you think they'll get here? Oh, a year. Just one year from now. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two have no hope of beating them. Enjoy what little time you have left. <laughs> I... I see. That's pretty much it. Come on, Goku! Hang in there! It's not like you to give up so easily! <clears throat> Krillin, you know... Dying... is a lot worse than I thought it would be. <laughs> uh, yeah, but... Don't you worry! We're gonna bring you back really soon! <laughs> Thank you! Goku! What the? He's gone! Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Eh? Huh? Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. What? Uh, you, you're kidding, right? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up in a year's time. Me training this little runt is our best shot to stand a chance. Once Goku's revived, Tell him he'll get his son back, and in better shape than he left him. Meanwhile, on a planet far, far from Earth... Raditz, the bastard went and got himself killed. He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth, for immortality. Can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. And that 
is why I brought him here as he is, to be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000-mile-long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully, other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes. We've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's Guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong! But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Mana... mana what work? Now then, to help you better understand... Uh, well... Uh... Well then, if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the... Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right, next question. Correct. Of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yama. You are more powerful. Right. Next question. That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come here. Like your brother. He wasn't an Earthling. Next question. Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those pair to shed some light? Oh, uh... Whatever. Sorry. Huh? What? This is the fifth question, right? Really? Um, one? Hmm, of course it was, I... And you... Well, that was the truth! There's that trademark denial. Mm, uh, maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Oh, please forgive me, your highness. Boy, he's got one... Hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> oh, you think you're some sort of funny man. Hmm. That's enough of all this. I will allow you to see King Kai. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to. No, 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 Mr. I'm King Yemma. I haven't. <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy.